Well, good evening, folks. It's Richard Jean here. Beautiful evening here on Lake Gunnersville. I'm going to do uh, about, uh, let's see, probably about three hours of fishing this evening. Going to fish for largemouth, up relatively shallow, and I'm going to use a uh, Zoom products. Okay, this is a Zoom lizard, six inch lizard, solid center black. The water is still in bad shape here on Gunnersville, uh, especially back up in these coves. Uh, the water's real cloudy, almost muddy. Let's get with it and see what we can do this evening. The water temp has warm up, has warmed up, excuse me folks, to 58 degrees on the surface. The last couple of days we've had some pretty warm weather and it didn't take long to warm it up. Now I'm gonna be fishing probably anywhere from two to eight feet of water is what I'm gonna focus on. I'm gonna start off with just a Texas rig lizard um, with a 1 16th ounce bullet weight. This is a Zoom six inch lizard, solid center black. And I have a two alt Gamakatsu hook with, with uh, this is 10 pound test strand, high impact. And I'm using a Gander Mountain Rod, which I love this rod. It's light as a feather. It's a tournament series, six and a half foot long, medium action, with a loose spinning reel. It's the Tournament Pro. Real lightweight rig right here. But I tell you, super sensitive. And I'm going to be fishing, oh, clumps of milfoil, patches of it, stumps, oh, cover like that sparse cover back up in here these fish is starting to come up shallow here in lake gunnersville let's see if we can catch a couple this evening let's make us a cast right here i made a cast there in about four feet of water we've got like i say real patchy millful some of it's new and emergent grass it's starting to come up and I'm just gonna work this lizard real slow. Water stained. And I'm wanting to get a big bite if I can. I'm in some of it right there. Okay, once I feel some cover like that, I just barely move that bait. Real slow, I'm not in a hurry. And I'm waiting for that line to go thump. And hopefully it's a big one. Let's catch one. There's a bat, folks. Let's get him. That's a pretty good fish right here. No, he ain't. They just... <laughs> I'm excited. He ain't bad, is he? Not bad at all. That fish was a little bit shallower than what I thought he should have been, but that's fishing. That excited me. I get excited pretty quick out here, y'all. I know y'all have noticed that. I can't even talk now unless Nettie. First fish of the day. He's a little better than I thought. When I set the hook, he come up and bowled. Black lizard. This is the second video I've done on this. Except for the first one, I was using a black and blue. That's a healthy fish. Real shallow fish, just let him go. Go on back. These fish are looking good this year. There's a fish. Golly. It's good fish right here, folks. This is a good one. Did y'all hear that? Did y'all hear that drag? That fish almost. That's a big fish right here. That fish right there just about. I gotta keep him out of my trolling motor. Snuck up on me. 
What I did is I had my trolling motor going forward. Look here, what a fish. My goodness. And out of just thin, thin shallow water. Woo! Doggone it. Let's get him in the net. That's good. Come on in here. Now that, oh my goodness. We're going to weigh this fish. This is a big one. Woo! I got my scales. What had happened right there? I have my trolling motor going frontwards. Okay. I had my rod tip up. I'm excited. And I was going to stop my trolling motor. And it didn't seem like I was stopping. So I got confused which gear I had it in. Because at that time I got bit. And then uh, I wanted to set the hook. That's a good one though. Woo wee. That's what I wanted to catch back here this evening. It's a big female. And there she is. Okay. We're going to weigh it, this fish real quick. Put her in the net. I'll tear my scales and we'll see what this one weighs. Maybe they'll steady. 7 pounds, 11 ounces. That's a good fish. Good fish. 7-11. Woo! That's what that doggone black zoom lizard to do for you in dingy water. There she is, folks. Good fish. I mean a good one, and I'm tickled to death right there. Fishing real slow. The fish hadn't bit today. They've been real hard to catch. But I just stuck with it. You know, I mean, that's the way you got to do. Just stick stubborn and get them. Let's get her out of the water right here. I'm going to revive her. Hadn't had her out of the water long, but I want her to go back in good shape. That fish is going to make some good babies. Go on back, gal. There she goes. Best part of it. Letting them go. Let's catch another one. I'm going to slip back in here again. See if we can't get another bite like that. Wouldn't it be nice to... I see a little activity right in there. Got some shad back here. And a lot of them bunched up. So I'm just going to... Now I'm throwing up in about two and a half feet of water, two and a half, three feet of water. And I'm just picking this bait up, folks, real slow. Moving it about an inch and a half, two inches, just like that. Letting it sit there. Just barely moving it like that. I'm fishing for a big fish. Now, Elmo ain't here today because he burnt some beans last night. He was the cook. He wasn't watching them. Hey, he burnt those doggone beans. Now, made his wife mad because she had to go 20 miles up the road to Piggly Wiggly's and get some more beans. So, Elmo, he's in the doghouse. Let's catch another one. There's a fish. Let's get him, folks. Mm. Look at there. I want y'all to look. I changed up to a trick worm. And I got way back up in here in real shallow water. <laughs> Now that's a lot of fun right there. Golly, he's giving me a fit. Ain't that pretty. I kind of changed up my pattern right here. Dang, come on back, come back, come back, come back. 
How are you fighting so hard like that? That's why. That's a chunky fish right there. Changed up a little bit and balloon. Good fish right there. They ain't nothing like it. No, I mean, that's a football. Is that not? They. Let's let him go. Go on back. <laughs> that's a lot of fun. Hey. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Hey. There's a fish. There we go. Ooh, that's a good one right here. Or a pretty doggone good one. Folks, I had to catch one more. Look here what a fish. <laughs> I couldn't quit fishing. Oh, me. I had to try one more hole. That's a strong fish right here. Strong fish. I hope y'all can see him. It's close to dark. Dig, yo. Come on in here, boy. Love it. That's pretty bad when you can't quit fishing. There we go. That's a good fish right there. Hey. They ain't nothing like the sport of fishing. Woo! Okay. I hope nobody heard me. Let's let him go. Go on back. I tell you what. I just can't quit fish. All right, folks. That's the end of it for today. I'm going to head on home and eat some butter beans and cornbread again. I love them. There ain't nothing like them. And uh, just a simple technique, uh, six inch black zoom lizard, one sixteenth ounce bullet weight. Now today I had to fish real, real slow, real slow. Um, I knew where the structure was. Most of my fish was caught on stumps. And um, after going over a stump, I just let the bait soak and just barely move it. I just teased them in the back. That's what happened today. But uh, I want to give a birthday shout out to Kai Reynolds, who was born March the 1st. Kai, it's a little bit late, but I've been real busy here lately. Had a few things I had to get done. And I want to say this. I appreciate y'all spending the day with me once again. Hey, ha, 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 woo! And remember, go fishing when you can, but talk is good!